Alrighty, I call the regular meeting of the Milliken Town and Board of Trustees for November 20th, 2023 to order. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Will the town clerk please call roll? Trustee Beckman. Here. Trustee Dean. Here. Trustee Lane. Here. Trustee Meisner. Here. Trustee Wakeman. Here. Mayor Pro Tem Ehrlich. Here. Mayor Austin. Here. We have a swearing in uh, ceremony next, but we have a couple people out in the lobby that they need to come in. Yes, it's a public meeting. Mm -hmm. Do you want to do the agenda approval while we're waiting now? Yeah, I was just waiting for them to kind of come in. Mm. Okay, all right, there you go. All right, moving on with our agenda. Um, does anyone have any additions or deletions to the agenda? Hearing none, I'll take a motion. Motion to approve agenda as is. I second. Town clerk, please call for a vote. Trustee Dean. Yes. Trustee Lane. Yes. Trustee Meisner. Yes. Trustee Wakeman. Yes. Trustee Beckman. Yes. Mayor Pro Tem Ehrlich. Yes. Mayor Austin. Yes. Motion carries. Okay, great. Now that we're all here. Our town clerk, Carrie Reinberger, will commence with the swearing in of Randy Helzer for planning commission along with James Baugh as the alternate. I could have you gentlemen join me here, please. Raise your right hand and turn it after me. I state your name. <laughs> that I will support and enforce, that I will support and enforce the Constitution and laws, the Constitution and laws of the United States of America, United States of America and of the state of Colorado, state of Colorado and the ordinances of the town of Milliken, the ordinances of the town of Milliken and shall faithfully perform, and shall faithfully perform to the best of my abilities. Best of my abilities the duties of a planning commissioner, the duties of a planning commissioner of the town of Milliken. Of the town of Milliken. Congratulations. Thank you very much. You're Thanks, Kerry. Thank you. If you guys could just come in. Thank you, gentlemen, for your willingness to serve. Yes, ma'am. They keep disappearing. They're, it's a public meeting. They're allowed to attend. <laughs> it's like they're afraid of us or something. Uh, Are we frightening? Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> just checking. All righty. Uh, citizens' comments. Do we have any citizens' comments this evening? Our citizens won't join us. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Oh my God. Apparently not. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we'll move on. Um, is there any discussion or comments of the meeting minutes for November 8th, 2023? Hearing none, I'll take a motion. Move to approve. Second. Town clerk, please call for a vote. Trustee Lane. Yes. Trustee Meisner. Yes. Trustee Wakeman. Yes. Trustee Beckman. Yes. Trustee Dean. Yes. Mayor Pro Tem Ehrlich. Yes. Mayor Austin. Yes. Motion carries. Okay, thank you. And now we have the paid list of bills that we need to acknowledge. Does anybody have any questions or concerns on the bills? All righty, we'll move on. And next will be the town administrator's report. Administrator Powell. Thank you, Mayor. So better get this right. <clears throat> Hasn't been very long since our last meeting, so <laughs> my re report's a little short. Um, 
so I will be attending the Hillsborough Ditch uh, Board's annual meeting, which is taking place on Saturday, December 2nd. Um, we're actually at 9 a.m. We're actually holding it here in this room um, because there's some, oh, PowerPoints and such that, um, that um, both uh, of our water engineers, both Johnstown's and Milliken's water engineers want to present to the Hillsborough Ditch in regard to the Hillsborough change case that we're involved in together. So um, it'll be able to give the board, their board, uh, more information plus opportunity for them to ask any questions of them regarding this change case. <clears throat> if you remember a few weeks ago, uh, Mr. Richard Yeager um, spoke to the town board in regard to his building per permit. Um, just to keep you apprised, I have been in contact with him and um, I had him call in for an inspection on what he has already completed. That way what's been completed could be checked to make sure it was installed properly. Um, so uh, that passed inspection. He still has a lot of work to do, um, but he and I, um, I went ahead and allowed another six months on his permit, but he and I will remain in contact monthly in order to see what he's been able to accomplish. And I know in the winter months, he probably won't be able to do much, yeah. mm -hmm. but I think because his building permit's been outstanding for quite some time, I think this will be a good um, place for us to keep uh, in check with what's going on. So Thank help him along in getting this done. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, oh, I, and Pepper wanted me to remind you on Wednesday, November 29th, there will be a, a meeting with the comp plan um, steering committee uh, steering committee at five o'clock at town hall. And then following that, there will be an open house from 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. regarding the comp plan update. So that's Wednesday, yeah, Wednesday the 29th. Any questions? Questions from the board? Oh, um, all the Christmas lights look really nice. Well, we have our parks department to thank for that. Thank you all for your hard work. work. It looks good. Yes. And I think we got some new reindeer. Did we get some new reindeer this year? We got some new snowmen. Yeah. Okay. All right. I so, just knew it looked like there was more, more. Yeah, we put them all together this time. Okay. <laughs> so what we're trying to do, um, because a lot of the displays we have are from Home Depot and or Lowe's. And, and, and though they're nice, they only last a short period of time um, out in the elements like they are here. It's not like at home you can bring them in right away or they get brought in right away. Um, so we've been trying to upgrade to um, a little more of a commercial quality, if you will, uh, much like the garland that hangs down the lights <coughs> in town. Those were commercial, and, and we've had those now for three years, I believe, Keith, and they still are in really, really, really good shape. So the snowmen that you see are also from the same company. Um, so we invested in those this year. So Great. Keith wanted a little extra, and so we have a couple of snowmen at each end of town. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll try to do that as budget allows um, until we can um, really have higher quality, if you will, um, displays. Well, the town Christmas tree will be going, will be, have the ornaments on it on the Friday after Thanksgiving, and the week after that, it will be going up out here where it was last year. So. We've got the presents ready. I'm sorry, what presents? The presents that are out there waiting for it. Oh, <laughs> great, okay. <laughs> so. I don't yeah. think we those should, are lit up We yet. should plant a, just a pine tree, and we then did. we wouldn't have to put one up. We did, we did. and we don't have oh. great success in that area with the pine tree. Oh. Um, so that's probably the third pine tree that's been oh. in, um, in Disregard. There. Yeah. <laughs> it's a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> Some, I wish somebody thought of that before. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah. try. I'm really smart, guys. <laughs> so. Yeah is what it is but there we go all right any other comments or concerns this is a very short meeting because 
There's nothing on the consent agenda. There's nothing on the action agenda. So we go right to board member reports. Are there any? I would just like to apologize for for last week's meeting. I, ha I had my weeks mixed up. And on Friday, I went to see what was on the agenda and I saw the date and I'm like, that was two days ago. <laughs> so I've, I, I, I just really feel bad and I have to apologize to, to everyone for missing it that happens. meeting. So. Okay. Yeah. All right, if there's no further comments then. Yeah. Oh, Mayor? yes. I, I just want to wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thanks, Dan. Thank you. Okay. Have a happy Thanksgiving, uh, too. Well, I'd like to uh, uh, give a report on the uh, breakfast that the, was held at the Bad Russian for the veterans. It was an excellent breakfast. I uh, wish it had been advertised more, but it wasn't. Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, most everybody that showed up there came because of word of mouth. But um, it was an excellent breakfast, and uh, the people that were there, I think, really enjoyed it. So maybe next year we can uh, coordinate something and uh, get together with them and, and do something. Maybe the events committee can, can get together with their events uh, person and uh, do a little coordination of things. We'd be happy to. Thank you for bringing that to our attention. I did not know about it, I'll be honest. I didn't see it. It was on Facebook. It was through TRP. Oh, oops, didn't see it. Okay, any other comments? All right, I'll take a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Second. <laughs> All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Aye. Happy holidays, everybody. Wow. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>